obviously this particular property, uh, 21 of 28 Tumavera Street there in Cogra. I was there this afternoon. The slideshow is going to start. It is a beautiful home. Uh, the way that this one's been uh, put together, I just think it's uh, got a great flow to it. And the moment you walk in, uh, that exceptional layout, you really can't fault it. Uh, the privacy, the space, they've done a great job with this property and they've presented it uh, in an impeccable fashion. So congratulations to the owners of this property for the great job they've done and the way that it's been presented. North facing at the front of the villa, plenty of sun throughout it and a few, very few villas like this one ever change hands. In fact, Sean was telling me this afternoon, uh, based on his research, only three villas have changed hands in Cogra in the last 12 months. And this one on the Monterey side of Cogra really presents, so close to Scarborough Park as well, really presents an extraordinary opportunity to have a great lifestyle, a great investment, whatever it might be. Nothing to do. Move straight in. You've got the, that ensuite, the bathroom, the space, and of course, no doubt, that beautiful kitchen as well. What do you say here tonight? If you are buy, if you are looking to buy and you are registered, I wish you the very best of luck with tonight auction. Uh, Sean has been great in the campaign. He's been giving you all the details and telling you where you need to be in order to be successful. So I wish you the very best of luck. We're looking for an opening bid to get things underway, boys. Good luck. Where do we start? We're bidding on 21 of 28 to Mavera Street in Cogra. Where does the bidding start tonight, boys? Good luck. $800,000? Is that $800,000 at number four? Congratulations and welcome to the bidding. $800,000, the opening bid buys, make no mistake, we are here to see, the, uh, here to see a new owner. At $800,000, the money looking for 10 as a minimum, I would have thought, but 10 over there at 810 and 20 quickly, 820 and 30 if you like, man, 830 and 40 next, and 50 next, man, what do you say? 840 the money, 850 next, what do you say? 840 the money, what? 840 twice, 840 the money, congratulations, man. 850 the money, number 11 over there, and 860 the bidding over here. At 860 the money, 870, what do you say? 860 the money here in the front. 870 if you like. 870 over here and 880 the money. And 890, man, what do you say? 880,000 dollars a bid. 890 next, what do you say? 880, congratulations, man. Once, twice. 890, good bidding, and 900 if you like. $890,000, so much enthusiasm, and then finished. You've got to have a five, man, right? $890,000 the bid, another five if you like. Sean just needs an extra moment over here at 890. 895 now the money. Can I see your card please? 895 at number 11. Good bidding at 895 now. 895 the money, do I have 900? 895 the bid now, do I have 900? $895,000 the call. 900 to advance. 895 the bid. 900 to bring you back in. Otherwise, at $895,000, the bid's over here. Make no mistake, 895 the bid. Happy to sell Sean? All right, we call it now once. Twice. Anyone else in the room want to talk to Sean, Mario, Ray, anyone else? Third. Final time. What about a one? Okay. People turn up with a hard limit and it turns out you mean it. That's okay. 895 the money. Is there any better offer? 895 is going to sell. What? Twice. It all goes. Happy to sell? Third final time, 895 it goes. So congratulations over here, well done. Commiserations to our underbidders here tonight and congratulations to our owners as well. Of course, no doubt, and as well, Sean Romani over here who ran a great campaign.